morning everyone and welcome back to my channel if you're new my name is isabella i'm going to be a sophomore at carnegie mellon and i make a lot of college health lifestyle vlogs and related content so be sure to subscribe if you want to stick around today i'm home for summer and i'm going to be filming a productive like summer work day i have been having like too many like days where i don't get what i need to get done because i've just been seeing people but um like i need to have like a work day today so that's my plan I actually woke up at 5.30 naturally, which I know is like crazy and like really weird, but my I'm like a natural morning person. Like I wake I woke up that early without an alarm, completely awake, and so there'd be no chance of me going back to sleep. Also, like it's good for me to start getting up earlier because usually in the summer I'll sleep until like 6.45 or 7, um, but I need to start getting up earlier because I start like actual real life work next week, and also I want to get in a run before... Um, it gets too hot outside because it's Texas. It's going to get super hot. Today, um, after I run, I'm going to go see one of my friends probably for a little bit at um, the cross-country camp where my high school practices. And then I'm going to come back and then I have videos to film, videos to edit. I have things to do for my job next week and things to do for my other job that starts on July 1st. So there's just like a lot of work I need to do and I've just been... Oh, I also need to pack because today's Thursday. I'm leaving on Tuesday to go back to Pittsburgh because I'm working jobs over the summer. You can see that in one of my other vlogs um, where I describe what I'm doing this summer. It's called No, I Didn't Get an Internship This Summer. But um, so I have to pack, have to do those job things, have to do YouTube stuff because I've been working so much on YouTube lately. So that's the plan for right now. Right now, I'm just going to like, relax and like edit a little bit before I get on my run. So I have five miles on the schedule today and it should be good. So I'm really excited. I just got dressed and had a slight change of plans. Yes, this is what I was wearing in my last video. I wear the same thing to run a lot. But um, I decided I really can't run by myself because I'm like just don't want to. So I'm meeting with some friends at cross country to run um, with Alyssa, who you guys probably have seen before. So that's where I'm going. I have five miles. So like, I just can't do it alone right now. <laughs> I'm just not in the mood. So that is where I'm going. The weather's a little bit cooler and it's still early. So we're starting the run at seven. So pretty excited. And I will try to film a little bit on the run and then come home and have a nice productive day. I'm like mid-squat, like pooping the entire like bark I'm vlogging today. Hi. Hello. This is Alyssa. My Hello. best friend. <laughs> uh, I am on the same. We We're just finished at the Crimson running. Crimson Talon Track Club. We just finished running four. together. Oh yeah, oh my god, it's only been a week, so I don't know, this is like really weird, I can't see anything, but we're having a great time, so great run today. <laughs> I'm back home, and I had a great run, it was just like, kind of too fast for me, um, cause like, faster than I probably should be going, but it felt great, so, I didn't feel great, but it felt like a good run, like I put in a good effort, and I like running with my friends, so. I'm eating a grapefruit and some frozen bananas, I know it's like really weird, and I'm not eating all of these, but I love having grapefruit after I run, and then just like some other frozen bananas, because I need to eat them before I leave, because like no one else is gonna eat them. So I'm just gonna eat this real quick, then go shower. You need to go get in a lift later, so, but I'm just like, don't wanna do it right now, so I'll go do it like this afternoon and take a break, so that's the plan for right now. I am so tired, my legs are honestly dead from that run, but I have a lot to do today, but luckily it's all like chill stuff. The only thing I have to do is go get in a lift today because I try to lift on days that are hard so like the next day I can be like full total recovery. Um, so I just need to do that. So I'm gonna get ready right now. Um, and then, I don't know, I think I'm gonna wait to film because I have to wait for my hair to dry because I washed it because my hair was so gross. And then I need to edit two videos and then do some stuff for work, so kind of busy i also have to delete everything off of this sd card because it's getting full but um yeah so i'm just gonna get ready real quick like do makeup for just filming and then we'll go from there also i'm like really happy because i finally figured out like how to do makeup so um i've like been doing makeup but i've just been doing it like wrong so i know like foundation first then concealer and using like how to use a beauty blender blender appropriately and everything like moistening it and all that and then like putting it on your hand and then putting it on your face and it's just like going on a lot better and easier so i'm really happy about okay, it i'm watching kenzie elizabeth's vlog right now and i'm also just trying to like delete everything off my sd card but i accidentally just deleted like today so i'm gonna stop even though i only got like 45 minutes cleared but every time i upload on youtube i always just like delete the footage um like off my computer to save space and i'm trying to delete off the card to save space because that saves money so you have to keep buying new sd cards and i don't know i don't like when people are sentimental about like video footage because like it's on youtube 
like it's fine and so like it's just a good way to save money so pro tip right there so there's like a couple things i'm going to be working on until i film my but um my princess polly haul later which i don't really want to film because like i saw abby aceland said this in a vlog but like basically for like hauls like they don't do that well usually but and they take a lot of time to film because you have to try everything on but i love watching them i know like not a lot of people like watching them but i love watching trying hauls just because i like really love clothes so i'm gonna film that just anyways because i also want to wash all those clothes but i have to do this like research training like compliance course I need to edit this video like non-negotiable because it's for a sponsorship and like get it approved and then i have to and then i have to do this like strength finder thing for my other job this summer so i'm gonna actually do this first because i feel like it won't take this much time i'll start working on this and then i'll edit the video and then i'll go film so that's how we stay productive out. Also, I'm like sitting on like this like stuffed animal, this stuffed land thing because this is where I sit when I'm not like clean. I don't want to sit on my desk. I just sit on my stuffed giant lamb in the corner of my room. So, so I just like the Gallup like strength finder thing for work. And my five things that it gave me were discipline, responsibility, empathy, consistency, and strategic. And I definitely think that's like me like that was pretty accurate so i'm really like i don't know glad that those are mine i mean this you really can't get a bad answer from this but yeah so now i'm on to do my other two things and then i'll film all right so i'm about to film my try on haul with all of these clothes right here so all of these um yeah honestly i just kind of want to get this film so that way i can like wash my clothes so i can start wearing them and then i can like get on my day i'm really not in the mood to do this right now but like i think like once i start filming like it'll be better so i'm gonna get started because i want to get this done kind of quick <laughs> so um the hardest part is just definitely trying everything on again because i already tried it on when it came to make sure it fit and i have to do it again so all right so i just finished the like talking portion of the the trend haul and now i have to film the actual clothes portion so that's gonna be a twosie and i'm gonna get started right now finished filming and it didn't take as long as i thought now i just have to change and head to the gym to lift because i gotta lift today because it's a hard day but also just like sneak peek i love this outfit so much this skirt oh my gosh i watched my try on haul to find out where it's from as well as this top like i just this is like gonna be my look of the summer in pittsburgh Yes. All right, I'm off to the gym. I actually have a pretty hard lift today that I was like given to do for cross country, but you know, make the hard days hard and the easy days easy. So I actually like never wear tank tops to the gym or like actual workout clothes. I usually just wear a t-shirt, but since it's gonna be hard, I'm wearing this tank top from Lululemon and then these shorts are just from Old Navy. So, and I really like this tank top. It's like 4.30, so it's gonna be like kind of late when I get there compared to usual. So I just really hope it's not too crowded. So I will. I'm probably gonna stop at the grocery store after two to pick up some stuff for dinner. So stay tuned. All right, so honestly, not gonna lie, kind of not the best gym experience. I mean, I got in 35 minutes and like it was good and like I squatted well and like whatnot. But okay, so lots of things happened. First off, I couldn't do like all the circuits that I was given like for cross country because the gym was so crowded and like every single thing I needed was taken up. So I just did like what I could and like replaced things when I could and did more sets of other things, which like worked out fine. But then when I was trying to squat, which is like honestly the most important thing I need to do, like I have to squat. Um, so when I was trying to turn off the air, which like it's so hot. When I was trying to squat, um, like it was too, the squat rack where I can like get the bar down was taken so then i went to the other squat rack where it was like too high and so i tried to adjust the hooks but then i couldn't get the bar off to get it to the other hook and this guy comes up and he's like are you using the squat like rack and i was like yeah and then i was like but you can have it because I, I was just like too shy i get so shy at the gym and he was like no it's okay and i was like well if i can't do this like 
I'm just gonna leave. And then I was like, okay, well, like, can you just help me like get this bar down? And he was like, yeah. And I was like, okay. And like, I just hate asking for help, so like that. And I hate seeming like weak and small, so like that didn't go very well. But then he like do my hit things, and then I'm walking out. And at this gym, I go to the YMCA, and I used to work here for like three, two and a half, for two years. So I worked here for two years, and so I know all the rules. And so this guy comes up, and he's like one of the trainers, and he was like, hey. And I was about to walk out, and he's like, hey, do you have a wristband? And I was like, what? And then I realized it was like the first thing that you need if you're 15, because you have to have a teen certification, like training if you're 15 or under, um, to be able to use the equipment. And I'm 19, and like I would, I was stopped when I was like 14 at the Y for not having it, so I got mine and whatnot. And I'm 19, so like I'm not gonna carry around with me. And I know I look young, but like I don't think I look 15. Like I'm wearing a full face of makeup, like I have my AirPods, like, and I worked out at this gym so many times and he's seen me so many times because I know this trainer and he still comes up and is like hey do you have a wristband and like I understand he it was like in his best interest and like he wasn't doing it to like be mean it was just like kind of a kick in the butt because like I'm literally like run for my college like I'm a sophomore in college like <laughs> so it's just kind of like like disheartening and like I know like this is so stupid to complain about it just made me like really shy like it wasn't even the fact that you made me look like young it was the fact that like I got called out in front of everyone which is like an insecurity of mine like I hate getting in trouble so like it just made me feel bad and then I was leaving anyway so I just grabbed my keys and left and he's probably like <laughs> he probably thought I was lying anyways I'm gonna go stop at Kroger um to get some food so I'm just glad like that's all done because I mean I had like an okay workout but I kind of wish it was better but you know it is what it is okay so I know this sounds really weird but this is like the best I can do in my car where I'm parked right now but I didn't, wasn't able to film inside Kroger because it was also really busy, but I just got a few things. So I got some more oat milk, literally my favorite. I'm on a mission to try every single brand of oat milk. I got, and then my other fun find, um, everything else kind of boring, was this s'mores flavored coffee. I usually don't get stuff like this, and I try not to get K-Cups, and I will get reusable ones eventually, but it just sounded really good. And then I got some avocados, some tofu, and some or go macro bars for fun. So that's what I got at Kroger, heading home. Okay, so I think I'm gonna buy something from Glossier because there is like, like I wanna do my eyebrows better and they obviously have great eyebrow stuff and they just came out with the new eyebrow thing and I've been wanting to try Glossier and you get 10% off your first order and free shipping over $30 so I can get eyebrow makeup. And I've been wanting to like fill my eyebrows in like a new and exciting way and I'm trying to decide between getting brow flick and boy brow or boy brow and a lipstick and I don't like, like I like lipstick, but I don't think I wear that much, so I'm gonna think. I think I'm gonna get brow flick and boy brow, but I can't decide. Just get clear boy brow or brown boy brow because I just don't know. Okay, so I read a Who What Wear article, which I love Who What Wear. Um, also would work there. So, um, about boy brow and boy brow flick. So I'm gonna get the glossier brow duo, and I'm so excited. Good brows, here I come. Because I also haven't been threading them because I wanted to get them like very like bigger and my eyebrows go pretty fast so just to make sure like this is what i'm getting brow flick in oh i got him blonde oh no brow flick and brown and then boy brow and clear so i just made myself a poke bowl and it has like tofu and like I get this like when I go pokey places but like I made it myself because it's cheaper and better so it has like seaweed tofu quinoa mango that's like real green onion cucumber and kale and then I put hoisin sauce and then sriracha and quinoa if you guys haven't following me since my food instagram like you've been here a long time because I've been using it in like two years so that's pretty good I feel like this is something I'd put on my food instagram but I'm not gonna use it anymore it's just an archival account now so you can go check it out it's at kale kilometers see my rich history um it's pretty good if you're from there that's pretty amazing so I'm gonna go eat this like great dinner that I made and I'll see you guys later <laughs> All right, so I just finished editing this video and I need to submit it to get it approved tomorrow because it's Friday, it's the last day of the work week. And so I'm a little bit behind, but I think it will be fine. So I'll submit this. And then um, I am really tired, I think just from working out a lot today and like just a really fast run this morning. Like 
I'm just like so exhausted like in the best way um and so I need to go stretch though like really bad because otherwise like I'll feel bad tomorrow on my run so I'm gonna go do that and watch dance moms I watch dance moms in like 10 minute spurts or like 20 minute spurts while I stretch and like foam roll because I don't I can't just like sit and watch tv so that's always been my style so I'm gonna go do that real quick um well I'll actually probably try to take some time to do it so I can really foam roll everything out and then that'll be it for this vlog I'm done working on YouTube and stuff for the day so that feels really great Guys, I'm gonna watch some more reality TV and go to sleep um, around 9.30 so I can get up early to go back to cross country practice tomorrow with um, my high school team. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's productive work day in my life. I'm sure you guys think my life is boring because I didn't go hang out with people today, but I did run with my friends. So you know what? At least I got a lot of work done. I got to see some people, had a great run. So it's all good. This is what a day would be like, kind of like working from home, but like I'm about to like not work from home in four days. So it's been a good time. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed today's video, be sure to give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Leave a comment down below and subscribe for more productive vlogs, college health and lifestyle content. And I will see you guys in my next video.